I received, <laughs> I received right before the stream funny news uh, in regards to uh, Liz Fong Jones crying his eyes out about the Kiwi Farms. He sent a DMCA to DNS Pod. DNS Pod is the DNS service that the forum uses right now. Uh, it is a subsidiary of Tencent, and it is also the DNS provider of things like the Daily Stormer. Um, so Liz Fong Jones has apparently been sending so many emails to the abuse uh, at e like the abuse contact email, and has received no response for weeks because we've been using it since December. So he instead sent a DMCA complaint, and the DMCA complaint just says. Um, help, I'm being harassed and defamed. Ooh, please check your email. Like literally it says, please check your email address. I've been I've been complaining to you. I've been complaining to you and you haven't replied to me. You haven't even identified my emails with a response. So he sends in the DMCA, which by the way, is technically sworn when you when you do these like online DMCA forms, you're technically swearing under penalty of perjury that uh what you're saying is is true and accurate. So he's using a, a a under penalty of perjury complaint form uh, to send a legal takedown notice that actually just says, by the way, this isn't actually a legal takedown notice. Uh, please address this other thing that I've been contacting you about for weeks. Um, but I replied as if it were a DMCA because he just links his thread and says, this is defamation. So I just reply saying that, you know, the the truth because sometimes people do send in like dmca takedown notices to other per service providers uh and they just put their thread and say this thread violates my copyright um so when those come in i don't usually go for the fair use route i just because it's very ambiguous you link to your your kiwi farmers thread and you said this thread is my copyright well no it's not it's mine actually um so my replies are always along the lines of this thread is 20 uh items of user generated content, which I have a license to republish in connection to the Kiwi forums forever in perpetuity, irrevocably. Uh, and you have no right to these posts actually. So you don't get to send a DMCA takedown unless this thread violates your copyrights because uh, you're, you're, um, you have no right to it. <laughs> you have no right to that thread. That's why that, that almost always works too. Actually not even almost always, it always works because it's, it's accurate. Um, but if he's, I don't know, it's just, it's just weird. It's like, you're going to try to DMCA a DNS provider. They don't facilitate the, the website. They're not even a host. They're not even a transit. It's bizarre. Belligerent train literally every day. Imagine this. Imagine, imagine your life being like this. You wake up every day and every day you're upset that there's a, a website online and you can't take it down. You've been trying for literally over a year. If you want to like fully calculate in all the time since uh, Trans Lifeline to now, I want to say it's been like five years. Imagine spending half a decade trying to take down a website and you haven't succeeded yet. Maybe he's the real Sisyphus. He has limited time on this earth. He has eyes that have a autoimmune disease and his autoimmune system flares up and attacks his own eyeballs. It sits there and it sees horrors as he undresses and dresses in the morning. He says, I cannot live my existence witnessing these horrors for year after year. And his body as an act of mercy attempts to blind him from the inside out. And he has this issue and there's only one way that it will end. One day he will be blind because of his, his condition. And he uses his time left with eyes for this world, staring at at the Kiwi Farms, <laughs> staring at my website, being angry about it. It's really beautiful in a way. It really shows me a level of dedication. Even I'm not dedica dedicated to the Kiwi Farms. If I knew that I had limited time to witness the beauties and natural wonders of this planet, I would not spend it um, hosting a website. I would spend it out in the woods like Teddy Kaczynski would be proud of that's funny thank you for watching this clip by colonel j this is the king of bold here remember to like and subscribe juice